Ready? Yeah. Ready for? What? What are you ready for? I don't know. What am I? Ready for CB Radio Show and Tell? Yeah. I think we should run to the house. Yeah, I get point. I bet I could be faster than you. Well, I have all the stuff on me and an encyclopedia on my me, backpack. Give me the backpack. I'm going to blow you out. And the crew. All right, we only, got, we only got minutes. How many minutes do we got? 27 oh, no. minutes. We got to bust out some videos. What do you think? Yeah. Tell the crowd. It's on. Ready. <laughs> Set. Go. Oh, there he goes. Oh, there he goes. Pops is catching you. Pops is catching you. Pops is going by. <laughs> what do you think? You think we're uh, that's enough running for today? Yeah. All right, we're off to CB Radio Show and Tell. Yes. All right, peace out. We'll peace catch out. you in the video. Welcome to CB Radio Show and Tell. I am number one, and this is Wizard Eighty Eight. Wizard Eighty Eight. Do you know what we're doing today? The goat and the duck. How did you know we're doing the goat and the duck? Because we messed up like nine times. Oh my gosh. All right, so in CB Radio Show and Tell, sometimes I see videos or pictures of things I've never seen or never even expected to see. So, do you know what I seen? No. I seen a goat in a truck <laughs> and a, a duck, duck in a truck. <laughs> the duck and a goat in the truck. Jason Lee Parker had a video. It's on our group here. You have to scroll through the videos, but you'll find it. This guy has a goat and a duck in the truck. He does? While he's getting ready to key down his radio. That <laughs> was mind boggling to me. And they actually kind of got along. Did you know that? They did? They did. They got along until the goat tried to headbutt the duck. <laughs> did it knock it out of the truck? The duck moved real quick. <laughs> and then the goat <laughs> fell? No, he didn't fall. All right, so I seen something else cool in the group by Tim Chambers. What? Okay. Do you remember tube style amplifiers? They got those big glass tubes in them and they yes. light up, they yes. kind of glow when they get warm. All right, so this guy's got an amplifier that he mounted a tube on the top of and he put an LED inside of it and when he keys up and he talks, it lights up red. It just goes poo. How cool is that? That's kind of neat because it's a novelty thing, but it looks old. You know what I mean? It just goes disco color. Da, da, da. No, just red, dude. No <laughs> disco colors. Be cool if it did. Go with the disco radio, right? Yeah. All right. So one other thing I seen this week was Rick Raider posted a picture of a box from the U.S. Post Office, right? Mm -hmm. And it was just smashed. Do you know what was inside the box? A radio. Poor Rick's 980, Uniden 980. Do you know what happened Did to it? Did he get a refund? Yeah, I'm sure he got a refund, but it got destroyed. Aww. The whole face got scratched up, the case got broke. See, this is the hazard I have with buying something over. There's other hazards of buying over the internet, but this is my main concern, and a lot of guys too. You get something, and it gets destroyed in shipping, and then you get stuck with something that's broke, and it don't work. That's a bummer deal, isn't it? Yep, that's a bummer. All right, so that's just a short video real quick. We're going to throw this one together, and uh, what are you going to tell everybody? Be cool. Be cool. We'll catch you on the next one. Peace out. Peace out.